Hi crypto fans, welcome back here with more news and today we're talking about the XRP and what is happening with the coin. We're going to discuss all of the information on this one. So let's start. What do we have here? XRP max supply 100 billion, 54% owned crypto exchanges, international banks, remittances, companies, you and me. 46% left will go to central banks, US financial institutions, US Federal Reserve. The train has left the station, but it's not too late to get on board. XRP ultimate use case token. XRP fee can be adjusted as a 001 unit. To summarize this, XRP will be burn out after 70,000 years. Next, 500 XRP X 2K dollars is 1 million. 100 XRP X 10K dollars is 1 million. Central bank adoption, Ripple IPO, XRP is a bridge currency for CBDC, XRP takes over shift. Uh, over SWIFT and XRP as a US reverse currency. Uh, yeah, most of these things won't happen, but we still can get a lot of things done. Uh, digital Euro, Digital Dollar, and I'm definitely in the camp of opportunities, including banks. XRP, medium of exchange. A um, uh, huge, huge, very important alert. XRP community witnessing a global shift and BRICS nations moving towards de-dollarization de de with China and Saudi Arabia leading the charge. This opens doors for XRP as a key player in this new era uh, of cross-border transactions and the future of global trade could very well be shaped by blockchain technology. Stay tuned for groundbreaking crypto evolution. And this one starts pretty soon. While the world is distracted, if you do not know who this man is, if you need to wake up, uh, Augustine Kirsten is the general manager of the BIS. He just spoke at the CBDC and Future Monetary System uh, Seminar, Seoul, Korea, 23rd to November 2023. Look at what he said. Uh, from the above, it is clear that there's three main components of the unified ledger are digital and programmable money, digital assets and the digital infrastructure that supports their operation and integrity. And for all of these three components to work together, the key step is tokenization. Uh, a unified ledger would be a network of networks uh, that would allow various components of the financial system to work seamlessly uh, together. In particular, it would have the potential to combine the monetary system, their central bank money and commercial bank money, which other assets make impossible the institutional payment clearing and settlement of any transaction. Such a ledger would allow for the use of smart contracts and comp uh, composability, and a smart contract is a computer program that uh, executes a conditional if then and while commands. Compassibility means that many smart contracts covering a huge variety of transactions and situations can be bundled together like money Lego. With these new functionalities, any sequence of transactions in programmable money and digital assets could be automated and seamlessly integrated. This would eliminate the need for manual interve intervention that delay transactions. It also would also enable simu uh, simultaneous instant payments and atomic settlement across a whole range of assets. And is it there another one? So a unified ledger would be a network of networks. Uh, okay, we'll also uh, check out this information. Also this one. To harness the full benefit of tokenization, we need all the components to work together seamlessly. The key here is to guarantee that all the digital assets networks and interconnected and interoperable, the technology is already there to achieve this. The real challenge is to work out the legal and regulatory frameworks, the governance and the communication protocols needed for such a network of networks to operate. In short, we need to build the digital infrastructure. Next, we go here. XRP is everything Bitcoin uh, should be. Easy, inexpensive, stress-free, quick, safe, and energy efficient. E uh, ever wondered why I can't confident in XRP super messy? I sent my dad money from Dallas to Riyadh. It cost me less than a penny. He had it in seconds. Sometimes you've just got to use something to see how amazing it is. Yes, I've been making this uh, frictionless transaction since 2017. Too much sense to ignore. Uh, also, uh, this one possible in Verge HNS on XRP. If it plays out, the right shoulder low will uh, be approximately 58, uh, 58 cents. Nice uh, backtest confirmation of the bull flag. Breakout IHS uh, target will be 68 cents short term. Bull flag target will be 13th July high of 93 cents as the next target, but who knows. 
And yeah, this guy, uh, maybe not this guy, but one of the previous guys already posted about the possible uh, head and shoulders chart, just head and shoulders, who also had a possible cup and handle chart, and now it is possible inverse head and shoulders. So as I'm saying, charts not play out all the time and it all still depends on the Bitcoin so you still need to look into the Bitcoin charts most of the time and they play out most of the time but uh, some of them don't and you need to look into the news because news play a huge role on the cryptocurrency market not even XRP or Ethereum or anything just Bitcoin news play out a lot yes yeah, sometimes uh, the crypto uh, like the specific cryptocurrencies news play out good for the only this cryptocurrency but it's just for a small moment for like one or two uh, one to seven days and then the Bitcoin goes into the game again and everybody just follows Bitcoin for now it is what it is Grayscale endorses Ripple's XRP for global payment innovation and growth. Grayscale endorsement of Ripple's XRP for cross-border payment signals a shift in blockchain's role in a global finance. XRP's how P2M features enhances transaction security, signaling a potential surge in XRP valued beyond the $25. Ripple's strategies could challenge Swift, paving the way for a more efficient global financial system with the digital assets. In a recent tweet by a Fiat League, a prominent figure in the blockchain grayscale has underscored the strengths of Ripple's XRP in the arena of cross-border payments. This endorsement highlights XRP's growing influence and potential in reshaping international money transfers. Amidst various developments, including programmatic sales, the SEC appeal risk, and the ongoing Coinbase case, XRP's role in a Ripple's on-demand liquidity service gains particular significance. This attention comes in the wake of SEC chair against uh, SEC share Gary Gensler's uh, contrasting views on XRP and Ripple ODL, adding lawyers layers to the narrative of digital currencies in a global financial. Um, Ripple leveraging its XRP asset aims to transfer the 300 trillion cross-border payments market. Their strategy, as elucidated by Piga Sultani, head of payments product at Ripple, involves utilizing blockchain and XRP to simplify and enhance global financial flows. These steps are pivotal in revolutionizing cross-border transactions, promising to deliver swifter, more affordable and transparent international fund transfers. Um, XRP price successfully surged past important resistance. XRP has recently navigated past 26-day exponential moving average, a technical resistance that often passes a challenge uh, to sustaining upward trends. This breakthrough signifies a period of bullish momentum for the cryptocurrencies that now trades above this short-term moving average, indicating that buyers are currently exerting greater pressure than sellers in the market. And the significance of XRP's move past the 26 EMA cannot be overstated, and this level often acts as a litmus test for short-term market sentiment, where price movements above the suggest optimism while a deep below can signal caution of bear or bearish sentiment. Currently XRP stands above not only the 26 EMA but also other key moving averages which is a technical indicator of strong bullish momentum. However, a notable aspect, aspect that must be considered is the descending volume visible on the chart. Trading volume is a vital indicator of the market activity and a decrease in the volume during a price increase could imply a lack of commitment to the current price level potentially leading to a reversal or or price correction that we are looking into. That's all the news I got for you today on the XRP side. I already told you we're falling in trading volume and we continue on falling while the price consolidating. So the next big move is about to be in the next three days. See you in the next one and peace.